Welcome back to the channel, let's explore together. Today, we're checking out the first romantic comedy written entirely by bots. You guys have liked this series that Netflix put together, so I've been checking it out. Uh, the title card is A Love Tale of Tailors. <laughs> Oh boy. So if you don't know what these are, basically AIs are forced to watch a lot of movies and then create one of their own. So we've done the horror movies, the stand-up comedian. Now we're on the romantic comedy. Comment below what we should hit next and let's go. Let's see what the robots have for us. A love tale of tailors. A love tale of tailors. Open on a beach with sand. Kay. We see a man, Noah, and a woman, Taylor. Kay. They are young professionals and professionally young. They're professionally young. That's good. They're, they're good at being young. They hold hands and feet. They are coupled. <laughs> they hold hands Taylor, and feet. We have dated for long years. It is time I do a thing. Oh, he's going to propose. Noah gets on a single knee. He pulls out a box. Taylor smiles teeth. Oh, good. She, she, she thinks she'll she eat a wedding cake soon. <laughs> I, I like that. That's her thought. She's like, oh, I'm going to eat a wedding cake soon. Propose we break up. Oh! Noah opens the box. Inside is his new girlfriend. Damn, Noah with the Uno reverse car. <laughs> All right, we, we're already at a thumbnail moment on this one. Look at this cheeky dude. Uh, let's get right next to him, just like a little, uh? <laughs> this dude. If you were here for the thumbnail moment and you're here for thumbnail moments in general, let me know below. Oh God, he got him with that Uno reverse. She looks like Taylor, but one day younger. One day younger, damn. Noah and new girlfriend leave on Noah's Ark. Wait, Taylor did this thing watch like Evan Almighty? Was that considered a romantic comedy? <laughs> what the hell? Taylor cries into the ocean, making it bigger. Damn, my that's a lot of tears. Has sailed away. Now I must marry my career. All Next right. day, Taylor is at her career. job in Big City. Yeah, she works for a magazine about magazines. I mean, this is way too accurate. This is every romantic comedy. They nailed it. I think this one's nailed the story structure more than the other ones. She sits at her desk, eating ice cream straight out of the tuba. The this tuba. co-worker is quirky because she has eyeglasses. Kirk, quirky co-worker, of course. Girl, men are from Mars, the terrible planet. Astrology told me this. <laughs> they are so bad but you need a new one. Bro, bro, I, the robots are trying to tell us something about how bad these romantic comedies are. <laughs> Use my kissing booth? Use my kissing booth. We see co-workers kissing booth. <laughs> it is kissing everything in the office just like a booth. That's just I like a damn booth. Now. Oh, wow. oh, only kisses documents now. Only kisses documents. God. Oh, I just got a big email from boss. The email is very huge. Oh it boy. It says, Taylor does fronts of magazines. Go on work trip now and find out. Better go to France and you're gonna find your new love there while you're trying to see if France has magazines. <laughs> Taylor jumps out of seat, excited to learn what France is. <laughs> she bumps into man who spills coffee all over his leg pants. Oh no. This is not meat cute. It is meat hideous. <laughs> Ouch. You are so idiot. It was accident. And those pants are bad anyway. These pants were my grandpa. Those was pants were his grandpa. Great someone. Hello. <laughs> I hate you and always will. I hate you also and I do not even know who or what or why you are. Okay, I guess they'll get married by the end. The boss rolls in before the two can exchange fists. <laughs> Taylor, this is new man employee. His new man Taylor. employee named na Taylor. <laughs> names are same, so you should do same things. Oh, that makes you sense. Go on the work trip Your names are the same, do the same things. Together. Both Taylors Oh, are they have to go on the trip together. Bummer. Two people at odds with each other being forced on a business trip together. Well, they'll find love. Upset, but their job is to go to France, so they must. They appear on airplane, but boss made airplane mistake. Only booked one seat and they have to share it. Oh, a little flirty moments they get stuck into. God, this is painfully true of crappy romantic comedies. They hate this in each other. <laughs> You're bad chair. I hate bad chair. <laughs> plane lands on top of Eiffel's tower. Oh, the plane just lands on top of the Eiffel Tower. Dope France stuff. Argue over how to once again be on the ground. I am a stairs man. I am elevator gal. <laughs> they go to hotel. But hotel also made mistake. Only bought one bed for entire hotel so they have to share. Yep. This is worst day of anyone's life. Do not talk to me. I need my jazz. <laughs> man Taylor turns on the music of jazz. Oh man. The notes calm him. What? You like jazzical music just like I do? <laughs> Impossible. You are a bad person. Jazz saved my life when I was drowning. <laughs> but girls do not jazz. Most girls are not me. This is 
<laughs> I'm not like the other girls. We've created our own generation of basic pumpkin spice latte women through these damn movies. Statistically true. This is Taylor shows Man true. Taylor her tattoo that is a picture of a jazz thing. <laughs> Man Taylor shows he has same tattoo. Oh no. I now hate to hate you. I love you. Taylor and Taylor hug on the bed. <laughs> In morning, Taylors do romance over Paris. <laughs> Their love is evident and loud. Wow. I must do a bathroom. He enters Ring Store. Man Taylor is lying. Ring Store has no bathroom, <gasps> only marriage circles. Oh no. Taylor writes a letter of love to Man Taylor, but sees worst letter of alphabet, the X. <laughs> worst letter of the alphabet, the X. You always got me with those zingers, robots, and now Noah's back. I want you back, babe. No, you are bad, but okay. Taylor and Noah <laughs> hop on the ark. And... No, you are bad, but okay. Yup. Just like a booth. Why Man... is this more accurate to real life now? Taylor leaves store with Ring and sees this. He has several questions, but is too sad to ask. Yep. I am sorry. No, you are Taylor, like me. <laughs> Taylor realizes this is true. She wonders who she should spend entire life with. Mean man with arc or okay man with same name. Okay man. Woof. It is true though. The ex is always the hot one with everything like going for him. And then the new guy is always the, you know, frumpy dude. Why is that the goal? Then she hears noise. We see man Taylor is singing her jazz. <laughs> it is our love song, Jazz Noise. Taylor smacks Noah and he flies to Mars. Oh, see you the later. Terrible man planet. Taylor terrible man planet man of Mars. Sounds like a great place. Taylor's arms. They Wednesday. I pronounce you they Taylor. They Wednesday. And also Taylor. You may kiss the Taylor. <laughs> <laughs> they do a traditional jazz kiss. Of course. They found each other. They found love. They did not find out if France has magazines. Oh, that's a bummer. They yeah. didn't even do their damn job. Well. What can I say? It's about as good as any romantic comedy I've ever seen. If you enjoyed that, don't forget to comment and let me know what you want me to check out next and subscribe so you'll be notified when we check it out. Until we explore again, I'll see you later.